Finally, there is something called the nibble. This got played on me so many times, this nibble. This is at the end after pressure and release. So they create a little pressure. Let's say you're selling a home. They create a little pressure like, oh, I don't know if I can extend it two more days. If you're delayed with the loan, you want to buy. And you know, this. how about this? You just uh, go ahead and pay $1,000 of the closing cost. What is that called? You're, you're buying a property for 800000 and they take a nibble. That's another 1000 another 500 You're with me on this? That nibble happens like this. You negotiate a deal with somebody, and everything is in agreement, and then last minute as you draft the paperwork, oh, so you will pay for the uh, coverage of such and such? So you will just go ahead and change the garage door? That's a nibble. Be aware of the nibble, and uh, once you negotiate things and write them down, don't let them nibble and try to take these little pieces from you. It just happens quite often in deals. Be aware of it. You can probably use it to your advantage if you want to, but it's just too petty, and it just leaves a sour point with the sellers or the buyers. I try to avoid it, and if people play that game with me, I, I try to stop it right away.